This stately home in New Jersey, one of a number targeted by the FBI as part of a series of raids on Wednesday. Arrests, searches and seizures taking place across nine states from California to New York. In total, at least 21 people from five states have been arrested for their role in a nationwide catalytic converter theft ring. We've also identified t tens of thousands of catalytic converters that have been taken on as well. It's a larger problem than we than we initially thought. The FBI says those indicted stole catalytic converters in multiple states. Then all of them ended up at DG Auto Parts in New Jersey. The bureau claims the company knowingly purchased the stolen converters, extracted the precious metals inside, and sold the materials for more than $545 million. It takes less than 30 seconds to really take these vehicles, to take these catalytic converters and make that profitability. All non-electric cars are equipped with a catalytic converter, which helps convert pollutant gases into less harmful ones. If stolen, repairs can cost thousands of dollars. Because of world events and supply chain issues, the price of those has skyrocketed in recent years. Some car owners are now trying to deter thieves by using a cable locking device. Police departments even holding etching events to deter thieves. Catalytic converter theft has become a nationwide problem. The resulting damage can make a car inoperable or, at the very least, illegal to drive under EPA regulations. Derek Dennis, ABC News, New York.